YouTube, what's going on? Woody P coming back with another one. Let's get it. You know, I can't stop. Let's keep it rolling. Let's keep it going. Today, I want to do a reaction video. I want to do a reaction video to a Larson Pippen interview last week. Larson Pippen says she has dating struggles now. She's struggling with dating, you know, after her divorce with her ex-husband, Scottie Pippen. Six-time NBA champion, Chicago Bulls. They had a divorce in December of 2021. And Larson Pippen is known now as like a home wrecker. She also had a fling with Future. That's well documented. Future even put it in his raps. I just hit your chick in some Gucci flip flops. <laughs> that's what Future say. So that's well documented, her, <laughs> her fling with Future. So, and Larson Pippen, she's known as a home wrecker. Like I said, she had a, another fling with Malik Beasley. He's a basketball player for the Minnesota Timberwolves. And she also had a fling with Tristan Thompson, who's NBA player for the Chicago Bulls. So Larson Pippen gets around. Kanye West even put her on blast on Twitter. So that lets you know, you know, what she's doing behind closed doors. And Kim Kardashian even cut her off. If any of you follow the Kardashians, that's also well documented that Kim Kardashian cut her off. So that was the reason they all cut her off. Not just Kim, Courtney, Chloe, they all cut her off. So Larson Pippen is known as a home wrecker. She's pretty much a fling. And she's struggling with dating now after her divorce with Scottie Pippen in December of 2021. So yeah, this is going to be a good one. I want to do a reaction to this. So yeah, stick with me on this one. This is going to be a good one. Before I start the video, please watch the entire video. And if you like the video, subscribe to the channel to receive more content like this and just content about life and various topics. Let's get it. You know I got to do some of my dating topics. You know, it's fun. So I got to touch on this. And I'm going to start with the little interview that Larson Pippen did last week. Just to give you some context of where I'm gonna go with this and how I'm gonna, you know, give my commentary. During a recent interview on Melissa George on Display Podcast via People, Larsa admitted that she constantly compares her new partner to the six time NBA champion, but not everybody checks all the boxes that Scotty did during their 23 year marriage. Larsa says this I feel like I'm kind of mentally in a place of like I was married to a really famous guy that was really cute, that has a good body, that was really successful, that gave me four gorgeous kids, she said. So where the hell are you gonna find that? It doesn't have to be all of those, but like few of those boxes. She added, it's kind of hard. I thought it was going to be easier to be honest with you. Larsa also claims that she'll have to lower her standards since it's likely that she won't meet somebody that lives up to Scotty. You hear that? Larsa will have to lower her standards. So this is what I was talking about with her recent dating struggle. She has to lower her standards. Larsa Pippen is 47 years old. And this is the first time, you know, she's had to go through this because she's, like I said, she's had flings with Future, Malik Beasley, and Tristan Thompson, and this was all before the divorce was even finalized. Let's keep this in mind. Kim Kardashian cut her off two years. The Kardashians, I keep saying just Kim, it was all of them. The Kardashians cut her off two years ago. In 2020, 2019 it could have been. I don't follow them like that, you know, but I follow my dude, Ye. So I know it was at least two years ago, minimum. So they've been cut her off. But this is what you must understand. <laughs> you got to understand this. It's tough for women to lower their standards once they've been like given the world. And when you women know this. I got women that watch my channel. So I like to call it down the middle. I'm, I'm a fair person. I made a video yesterday holding a man accountable. So I hold everybody accountable. That's why I made a YouTube I'm calling everything out. <laughs> That's what I'm here for. <laughs> no, <but laughs> seriously. It's hard for women to lower their standards, especially when they've been living that lavish lifestyle. You can't be regular again. So she said she, it seems like she's going to have to lower her standards. She won't do that. Women, before they lower their standards, they'll rather have just flings with rich guys. 
to have money just so they can still be living that lifestyle before they actually settle down with the guy that was actually below what they're usually accustomed to. She's accustomed to what she say, a famous guy, really good looking, a champion, hall of famer. Like she said, she can't find a guy to check all those boxes. She won't. And all the men will simply, all the successful men that have money, they'll just treat her like a fling. She don't have no more value. I'm just being real. She's done. She done been, she done been to block too many times. <laughs> or she done been to block too many times, so... And it's well documented, like his pictures over the internet, you know, her holding hands with Malik Beasley, the basketball player for the Timberwolves. She got pictures with Future on the internet. And <laughs> this is funny. Future say the reason he end up, you know, taking Larsa down. Guess what? Guess what Future's reason was? You know, my reaction videos, I'm going to throw this humor in there. I'm going to definitely throw the humor in there on my reaction videos. But guess what Future's reasoning behind taking Larsa down? Guess what his reasoning was? He said when, <laughs> when he was younger, Scottie Pippen didn't give him an autograph. So that was his payback. That's what Future said. I don't know if I could believe that. I don't know if y'all believe that. But that was his reasoning. And then I'm going to tell you, it got so bad for Scotty, like, around, like, 2020, 2019, like, before he was going through the divorce process and he really didn't want to lose Larsa. Scotty was, before he didn't want to lose Larsa, he was losing his mind. Because Scotty, he started growing his hair out, trying to get braids. You know, he cutting his facial hair off. He trying to, he was trying to look, you know, 10, 15 years younger. He was trying to look like the guys that his, you know, ex-wife now, Larsa Pippen, was after. You know, guys in their, you know, early 40s or late 30s. Or even some of these NBA players. He had cornrows, Scottie Pippen. First time I ever seen Scottie Pippen with cornrows. He was dressing, he was Dressing different. Dressing more urban, more streetwear. I'm like, man, Scotty, he just got to be yourself, man. When it's over, it's over. Everything run its course. Plus, she wasn't holding him down anyway no more. So. It was time for him to move on. Honestly. But, yeah. She's definitely going to have trouble dating, you know, from here on out because guys will just treat her like a fling at this point, like Future did. So, she was done, honestly, once the Kardashians cut her off. Because once they cut you off, it's just like, it's a reason, like, why nobody can really deal with you no more. She was cut out the clan, so... Once that happened, it was all downhill from there. But yeah, that's definitely wanted to get some commentary reaction to this, but that's how I play out, though. I mean, she going to have to lower her standards at this point because Scotty, he dating these young things now. He done came back to his senses. You know, he done come back to his senses. Now he's... You know, got his confidence back. He's dating these young girls now. He's following the Leonardo, Leonardo DiCaprio. He's following in his footsteps. DiCaprio, as soon as you turn 25 as a female, he you out the door. Next. Leonardo don't play. He don't play. He just had a breakup. Check it out. Leonardo DiCaprio just had a breakup a couple days ago. There was memes all over the internet say, once you turn 25, pack your bags. <laughs> Mess around with Leonardo, but that's how it play out. But yeah, definitely wanted to get some commentary to this, give a reaction to this Larsa Pippen.
recent dating struggles since her divorce with Scotty and her fling with Future. But yeah, definitely wanted to give some commentary to this. Drop something in the comments. Let me know what y'all think. This was funny to me. Had to give a, you know, some commentary reaction to this. You know I can't stop. You know I can't stop. Let's keep it rolling. Let's keep it going. What if he coming back with another one? Knock another one out. Let's get it. Boom, boom, bow. Let's get it.